are the top 10 VR fitness apps in 2024. Let's start with this good old classic. X Fitness offers a variety of movement styles like squats, side lunges, boxing, slicing, and rotation, and offers the most customization of any other app on the list. Not only can you add your own music, but you can also create your own custom playlist, which allows you to include a warm up and cool down and work out for as long as you'd like without having to go back to the menu between each track. You can easily remove targets that you don't like, which is great because I have no idea how the shields and the exploding skulls are contributing to the workout. XFitness has been a community favorite for years now, and it's a great app for anyone who likes a lot of customization to set up their workout the way they want it. Unfortunately, it seems like the developers have moved away from this app and there hasn't been an update for over 18 months now but it still performs well and is still fun and makes you sweat. So I thought X Fitness deserved a spot on today's list. Next up is Powerbeats VR. This is another rhythm-based fitness-first app that includes all of the usual movements like punches, squats, side steps, trails to follow, and bombs to avoid. Each track has different difficulty levels to choose from, but I recommend avoiding the expert tracks as the obstacle design gets very fast and chaotic, making it difficult to duck into the tunnels without throwing yourself through the room and keeping up results in more flailing around than purposeful movements. There's also no playlist feature, so you do have to go back to the lobby after every song. Powerbeats VR is great for anyone who wants to just do their own thing and there's no community and no leaderboards and you have the option of bringing in your own music, which is really good because the original soundtrack is awful. And honestly, if you are at the stage in your journey where you're looking for just a little bit more demanding workouts, then I would recommend any of the other apps on this list ahead of Powerbeats VR. This next app is this year's outlier in that it is not a fitness first app, but has a killer soundtrack and engaging gameplay that is guaranteed to make you drip. Tiger Blade is just too good not to mention. The gameplay is very similar to that of a pistol whip campaign, without the bonus point of firing on beat and with more movement mechanics. Play through and unlock 10 different levels and then return to speedrun them from an extra intense workout. Each level is between 3 and 5 minutes long, but the amount of bullet dodging, sword swinging and hooking you have to do, those legs will be burning in no time. I usually try to focus on only VR fitness apps when I do these reviews, but Tiger Blade just came out in February and it immediately became one of my favorite games. So a huge thank you to the MetaQuest Creator Program for making it possible for me to try games I usually wouldn't be able to. Now, I find the speed runs of Tiger Blade extremely fun. So if you're someone who really likes your fitness gamified, definitely give Tiger Blade a try. Moving on with my list of the top VR fitness app, it is time to visit the only racket game on this year's list. Cyberx is a game that constantly surprised me with how much it makes me laugh. It's a game that is easy to get into and easy to master, as all you need to do is dissolve boxes by swinging a ball, or three, <laughs> at them, or shoot them. The game features different game modes like campaign or continuous, and it's the first right, game on this battle. year's list that has <laughs> multiplayer. Yeah. I love how Cybrix gives you a racket in each hand for a better workout, and reaching high and low for balls flying towards you is a great and fun way to get your heart rate up. Cybrix is a lot of fun to play on your own, but it's the four duo game modes that are my favorite. The app also has a mixed reality mode, which is super handy because it does require a little bit more side-to-side -side space than the other apps on this list. <laughs> but if you do have the space, I definitely recommend you give Cybrix a try. Ever since Dan Central VR decided to close its doors, there's been a big gap in the VR fitness offerings when it comes to dance. Fortunately, we recently got Les Mills Dance XR to fill that empty space. Les Mills has decades of experience teaching dance fitness to people all over the world. And they bring that knowledge to this app that offers classes that are between 4 and 18 minutes long, that to a variety of musical styles, and ranging from beginner to advanced. Their routines feature movements of every body part, which are guided and taught by top-tier instructors. You have the option of having a leaderboard that features recordings of other players and friends, 
or you can just get into the groove in a private dance class in either VR or mixed reality. Dance is such a good way to stay active as it not only gives you a cardiovascular workout, but learning new routines and moves is really great training for your brain, which comes in handy as we age. Dance is also really great for learning skills such as balance, coordination, and body awareness. So even if you're feeling like you're not getting the most intense workout, you're still improving on lots of great and important skills. This is a workout after all. Next up on this year's list of the top VR fitness apps is another community favorite. Audio Trip stands out from other rhythm games by implementing the cardio mode a version of each song that is specifically created to give you a great workout. And boy does it ever! The tracks offer moves like squats and side lunges, and Audio Trip is my go-to app for a good core workout in VR. Currently, the app features a collection of known and unknown songs in different genres, the option to use predetermined playlists or create your own, and they just released their first DLC music pack. Audio Trip just announced their roadmap for 2024, and I am so excited to see a lot of cool new features, including two more DLCs, and they're adding multiplayer. There's so many fun ways to work out and enjoy Audio Trip. I did a whole video on it. I'm gonna link it down in the description so you can check it out later. I have reached the first app on this year's list that is subscription days. Light Sports offers three different memberships, free, standard, and premium. The app also offers several different classes led by experienced instructors in target boxing, full circuit training, and resistance training. There are hundreds of classes to choose from, and although I don't find them all to be equally effective, and the class durations are on the shorter side, Lightsport has the most detailed tracking of all the apps on the list and an in-app community feature where you can challenge other users. Now, Lightsport is the only app that I have found that integrates weights into VR in a responsible way by utilizing the mixed reality mode, hand tracking, and allowing the users to move at their own pace. Now, if you do decide to give it a try, I definitely recommend that you set yourself up next to a mirror just so you can check on your form and stay safe in your workout. As I move into the top three VR fitness apps of 2024, the competition is getting a little bit tougher. And how I'm placing these last couple of apps is gonna depend a lot on personal preference as well as fitness level. In third place, I've put Supernatural. As one of the OG VR fitness apps, it has a variety of classes and fitness options, as well as an active online community. Although there's no multiplayer, you can follow other athletes in the app see their activity, and cheer them on. Supernatural is most known for their flow classes, which use large arm movements, rotations, squats, and lunges to get the heart rate up. They have also added a box format and offer stretching classes as well as mindfulness and meditation. The Bring classes are beginner-friendly and the instructors offer detailed explanation of the move. Now, although the classes are great for cardio and breaking a sweat, I just personally don't get the same like muscle burn like I do with the next two apps on this list, which is why I'm putting Supernatural as number three. But on the bright side, Supernatural just lowered their subscription fee by quite a lot. So if you've been curious to give it a try, now's the time. If I were to place Supernatural in one corner of the ring of VR fitness, then FitXR would be in the other. Where Supernatural uses real-life landscapes and trainers, FitXR has taken the virtual route with multiple environments and avatars. FitXR has significantly expanded its program offering over the past year, and you can now choose between boxing, combat, dance aerobics, pit, sculpt, zumba, and slam. The classes vary in length and intensity, including warm-ups and cooldowns. And you have the option of creating a multiplayer lobby for you and your workout friends. Unfortunately, as FitXR uses digital instructors, you can't really use them as a good representative of form when setting up for the exercises, which is why I find FitXR to be appropriate for more experienced users. I put FitXR ahead of Supernatural just because I find their classes to be more challenging and give me a better workout, even if I'm not a fan of the digital avatars. And I definitely hope that they will expand on their mixed reality offerings beyond just the Zumba Studio and Slam, just so you can stay safe and just avoid injuries when you're doing complicated moves such as step back lunges and low reaches. It is finally 
finally time to reveal the number one VR fitness app of 2024. And it should come as no surprise that once again, I am placing Body Combat XR on the top. Body Combat features over 50 full body workout classes and besides the regular boxing moves, it also includes squats, knees and elbow strikes, battle ropes and speed balls. With three different intensity levels, Body Combat is the only app on this year's list where the advanced classes give you enough time to engage your muscles and properly execute each movement, as opposed to having you move as fast as possible and flailing your arms around. The instructors cure you for upcoming moves and proper form, and the choreography fits the music perfectly. Although there's no multiplayer, you do have the option of having a leaderboard which shows scores from other users, and you can select to have your friends fill the lobby first. The new mixed reality mode makes it even easier to give it everything you got in every single workout, which will not only make you sweat, but your legs will get a good burn too. So there is a few different reasons why Body Combat XR is my number one VR fitness app in 2024. Now, the first thing is that this is a one-time fee app, so no subscriptions or anything like that. Buy it once and it's yours. Second is that the different levels of the workouts make the app safe and efficient to use for every fitness level. And although that I really enjoy how some of the other apps have a lot of different classes and programs that they offer, personally, Body Combat XR is just the best complement to my overall fitness routine, which consists of both VR workouts and non-VR workouts. If you're wondering which app will fit your routine best, then grab my free Spark Your VR Fitness Journey guide or send me an email and we can have a chat. One of the best ways to keep consistently active is to have a community that engages with you and holds you accountable. There are tons of great VR fitness apps that have multiplayer features and you can check out the best of them right here. And of course, feel free to join our Discord for weekly workouts and challenges.